It's beautiful. You know, speaking of calendars, huh? A long time ago, they used to be written in the earth, but they'd get blown away by the wind or wiped out by the rain. Or dogs and cats would walk over them, and their footprints would make the calendars illegible. So, to prevent the calendars from being erased, a new profession, the calendar guardian, was established. Really? <sighs> oh no, he's at it again. Where does he come up with these stories? Good morning, everyone. Huh? Hi, Eli. Hey, Eli. Hello, Sakura. You know all about calendars, don't you, Eli? Say what? Listen, Zachary. I don't think Eli knows what you're talking about. Isn't that right, Eli? Actually, I do know. Hmm? A long time ago in Europe, the calendar guardian was a highly coveted profession, you know? So people who played tricks on them and erased the calendars got into a lot of trouble. Isn't that true, Eli? Well, yes. There are many reported incidents and disputes published in the history books involving calendars. But the most famous of all involved the biggest and longest calendar ever recorded, which was in Egypt. Wouldn't you agree? They say that aliens created that calendar. <laughs> I think you and I are going to get along just fine, Eli. So do I. Is that really true about the aliens, Lee? Uh, I'm not sure.